So how you start a successful chama is by asking who are we in this particular group which you are calling a chama. And number one is by defining goals. What do you want to achieve as a group? What are your investment goals? How long would you want to run this chama? And what are the details in terms of um, the short-term goals and the long-term goals, which is very, which is advisable to have? Additionally, you need to vet your, the members who are going to be in this chama. And by vetting is simply you're saying uh, the members who are joining are their goals aligned to the chama goals so that then there is that kind of continuity with the, with the goals of the chama even at one point or another where you might find challenges or opportunities that might be conflicting with the chama. Thirdly, you need to choose the leaders who are going to be leading this successful chama. And this, we are talking about the chair lady or the chairman. We are talking about the secretary who handles the administrative parts or purposes of the group. You are talking about the treasurer who handles, you know, the, the, the money aspect of the group. And of course, now you go down and look at when you open accounts, who are going to be the signatories? How will they handle the accounts? of the chama. So once you have already set up your chama, you've defined your goals and broken down the goals into short and long term goals, you've already vetted the members, you already have a leadership in place. Number four you need to look at is now the contribution. How much are you going to be contributed contributing and at what intervals. There are chamas that may decide monthly intervals make sense. There are other chamas that you may find yourself that a weekly sort of deposit makes sense into the chama. There are others who decide on a quarterly basis. All this should be aligned to again your goals as a chama. Additionally as a chama decide on areas where you invest your funds and also the ways and a simple um, thing is that you can identify for example this is the amount of money that we look to be achieving on a year-to-year -year basis and this is how we are going to split ourselves for example you can decide we are going to invest some in some areas where it's a bit more liquid you know the real estate and the like into businesses then there's some more money would like to be able to run other concurrent activities of the chama for example you can decide to invest in um, funds that allow easy access of the money back but then as long as they're in whatever area you've invested they are earning an income that beats the inflation of the country at any one point. Um, meetings as a chama is the, really the crux of the matter because when you do meetings is when you are able to share ideas, to look at the chama, how, how are you able to achieve your goals, what are the objectives that you still have on a short term and long term uh, period of time and then you need to decide on also the timing are you going to again go back to monthly meetings and also the agendas that um, would be handled at any one meeting of course you have the aobs look at also where you have these meetings for example there are chamas that take advantage of their membership where you look at if you have um, you know the hotels and so and such kind of thing where you meet there and then you're able to support each other's business. Last but not least, it's very important to agree on the exit clauses of a member and the administrative uh, obligations that will follow should a member want to exit the group. In summary, let's draw a picture image. And this is a triangle where at the top you have the goals and the goals you have broken down in intervals of the short-term goals of the group and you also have the long-term goals of the group which is the chama in question on this other side you have the people who are the these people and they are the members you're talking about um, their goals 
being aligned to the Chama goals and the right side of the triangle here we are looking at the activities, the meetings, the contributions and also the investment itself.